What's up everybody? The weekend is almost here and we are back with another video. Come on and check it out. All right, everybody. If you watched last week's video, you would have seen that we had two projects that we were trying to put together. My project was finished, which was the cornhole pit, but unfortunately, Kim's project ran into a little bit of a snag, right, honey? <laughs> Let's just say I was never meant to be a farmer. <laughs> would love to be. I've always, but you knew that, I've always wanted to own a farm. I mean, I know that sounds crazy. I used to tell my friends that. No one believed me, but I'm dead serious. Like, I would have loved to have been a farmer in another life. <laughs> so that's why I'm shocked that it took me so long to try to plant my own crops. Right. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> oh, so, <okay. laughs> our rotary tiller decided that it didn't want to play nice with others, but you can check that out in the other video, you'll see. But still, we were not defeated. So what I'm gonna do is, we're gonna take a look at our, our little mini crops because we didn't really want to invest a lot of money in something that may or may not work because I don't have a green thumb. Like li literally, I, I can't grow anything. So <laughs> I'm shocked. I actually checked this twice a day I check it in the morning when I let Shala out and I check it in the evening like I'm like all proud of myself. <laughs> Farmer Kim here, you know? All right, so if you haven't seen that video, you can see it here. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna show you a little bit of last week's video leading up into this week's video. So check it out right here. My garden is not working out so <laughs> gonna have to come up with a plan B because plan A just did not work so we'll let you know what plan B is so we get ready to go to the store in a little bit and hopefully we'll find something that's going to work better than what we had initially planned which is luck hi guys so it is now 618 and I have not planted one thing. It has been, I feel defeated, but it's not gonna happen. So we came up with a plan B. We'll show you what that is, but it's getting late. And guess yes, I just hope it isn't pitiful. I don't wanna embarrass myself. All right, we're gonna make it work. <laughs> So we found these, I should say my mother did. So we are putting our plants inside of these pots. <laughs> What is that you're playing? Cucumbers and because I don't know what is what. So we're leaving the little tags in it so we will know what's what's uh what's actually growing. I've never done this before in my life, people, so <laughs> 
This is all brand new. But we have been to two different stores today to find stuff. So that's going to be a whole row of cucumber? Yep, whole row of cucumber. Well, I think that's what we got. These two are cucumbers. Is there more? Or did you just get those two? I think I might have just been these two. Do you want me to go check real quick? Yeah, if you don't mind. All right. All right, this is green peppers. That in one box, so that's probably pretty big. Okay, so we got lettuce, cilantro, basil, strawberries, zucchini, onions, and tomatoes, and I don't know what all else we have here. So we are trying to just try to grow a little garden, but our plan didn't work where we wanted it uh, out back where it's our rotor tiller decided that it didn't want to play well with others so we did not dig up the ground so we will let you know and keep you posted with how this works out for us dave's already out back playing cornhole in his new cornhole pit that he just put together so i am done for the day we've been up early this morning and it was just one thing after another but i refuse to be defeated by a garden okay all right, talk to you guys later. All right, Kim, so what do you want to do now? First of all, people, take it easy on me. I have never planted stuff before in my life. Don't, please don't bash me. Be nice to a little old lady. <laughs> but I'm going to show you my little mini crops that we decided to grow. And like I said, I put the stickers by them so I would know what they were because again i've never planted anything in my life so i'd plant it in there and then someone would say what is that and i'd be like i don't know but come on let's take a look so right here we actually have cabbage over here we have different types of uh, herbs we have uh, parsley basil Mexican tarragon, peppers, and if you, if you look at the other video, you'll see how much they've actually grown. Okay, so over here we have strawberries. Did you see back here? There's a couple here that have actually started. I might be able to eat this one. Uh, yeah. That looks good and see these are starting to grow. So here we also have, uh, we have pesto and jalapenos and strawberries. Did you put any tomatoes in there? Nope, the tomatoes over there. <laughs> here are the tomatoes, which I'm probably gonna have to get, I guess a steak or something, cause they're starting to lean over. As you see that right there, it's starting to, it's starting to lean, which means it's getting 
get heavy getting getting bigger which is it's good yay we also have onions and we have just a basic lettuce which is over there so And we have uh, squash and cucumbers as well. So we just got a couple of little plants just to see how it would work. But I got to tell you, this was actually a fun family project. So we might, if this works out, we might actually get more of these and then start to plant more. And then I'll actually be a farmer. <laughs> okay, that was a quick look at our crops and everything that we had planted. And I gotta say that this would actually be a fun project for people. These are actually, these containers are actually called patio pickers. So if you have small kids, you can actually have these on your patio and plant something so your kids can watch them grow. Cause we really did have a fun time, as you can see in the video with, you know, my daughter, my niece, her girlfriend, my grandson, my granddaughter. She had gone walking with my other uh, niece, Bobby. So, but we really did have a fun day just looking for the plants that we wanted to plant. And I think it was just something good, ever, just something to get everybody outside. And you know what? I think it was good that you guys started with um, some crops, if you want to call them that, that were already starting to grow as opposed to just planting seeds. So that was a good idea to get yeah, started I with. I, tr I tried to think of something. So, um, especially because this is something new, even though it was small, um, I did want it to work. So I figured, hopefully I won't kill it. It's already started, so. Well, honey, I think you did a good job. Thank you very much. All right. <laughs> Farmer Kim, you all. <laughs> <laughs> He's laughing and joking, but he'll tell you, I've, all, I've told him several times that if I ever came into a boatload of money, I'm buying a farm and I'm being a farmer. You know, something you want to do. It's huh? just something that I um, I want to do. So. All right. So folks, that takes care of this week's video, part two of our two project weekend. Um, we hope that you like, would like this video, give it a thumbs up. If you haven't already, please subscribe to our channel, help us out. And also, if you want to receive notifications, hit that notification bell and you will get a notification because we upload our videos every Friday at 9 a.m. All right. So we're going to move right on and say that here's hoping that you have a, a wonderful, wonderful weekend. weekend. All right, folks, we'll see you later. Bye. Go take care of those crops. I know that's right. <laughs>